The discharge of untreated industrial effluents, along with municipal waste in the environment, pollutes the soil and water while posing a major threat to public health in Pakistan. The traditional methods for wastewater treatment are not only inadequate, but also small and medium enterprises and larger organizations in Pakistan are incapable of implementing these traditional methods due to high capital, operational, and maintenance costs, and also a lack of trained manpower. So, floating treatment wetlands, or FTWs, are a nature-based solution for low-cost wastewater treatment in suburban areas. They employ the use of naturally existing aquatic plants to break down and take up the pollutants in wastewater. The process begins with the wastewater from a community entering into a depressed area or an artificial pond, where plants are vegetated on soilless, buoyant mats in a manner that underground biomass hangs freely in the water column flowing underneath. Aquatic plants are deployed into the pond, covering at least 40 to 50% of the pond surface area. The wastewater that comes into contact with the plant roots takes up the pollutants. The two to three meter long plant root matrix underwater acts as a physical and biological filter while breaking down and consuming the pollutants present in the wastewater. The treated wastewater can be used for aquaculture, agriculture, or horticulture depending on the extent of treatment. The thick vegetation of these FTWs serves as a habitat for several bird species. Moreover, they reduce odor and are aesthetically pleasing. These nature-based solutions help in the restoration of wetlands. On average, 19,000 cubic meters per year of wastewater is estimated to be treated through a floating treatment wetland installed in a wastewater pond with the size of one acre and depth of one meter with an average daily wastewater flow of approximately 50 to 70 gallons per person per day.